and some of the crowd getting ready to leave, but a lot of people spend the weekend here, so. So the wrestling action is all wrapped up now, and a quick rundown in case you missed anything. At 91 pounds, Joe Lafredo was defeated by Rick Brzezinski. At 98 pounds, it was Gene McNeil over Butch Hibbard. Phil Consiglio defeated Paul Lanfear, Jeff Clark over Tony Melfi, Trevor Ernie narrowly over Willie Warren, Marty King defeated Darren Cummings, it was a Joe Plant over Tim Quinn, Mike Arena defeated Tom Becker, John Sir beat John Barrett, Brian Curlander over Ron LaSorsa, Jason Morris beat Zakowski, Zakowski. and it was uh, Himes over Shojan, Ellis pinned Alto Brando, and just now uh, Randy Morrison with a pin over Larry Simons. Incidentally, we have the final standing. Section 5 finished first with 207. Section 11 was runner up with 185. Then it goes Section 6 was third. Section 4 was fourth. And Section 3 was fifth. So a lot of good wrestling action, but Section 5 able to pull it out. Those head to head matches, they came through and beat Section 11. So Section 5 last year, which was upset basically by Section 11 at the end, came through. Section 5 winning the state championship for the first time since 1981. No announcement yet on the most outstanding wrestler, but we hope you enjoyed it here on Cable 13 Sports tonight. For Dale Drypolter, I'm Dave Cohen. Thanks for being with us here on Cable 13 Sports. The New York State High School Wrestling Championships have been produced by Bob Jubinville. Our director, Gary Mariano. Our technical director, Dick LaRose, and our remote supervisor, Andy Swyde. Now for all of us at Cable 13 Sports, our thanks for being with us tonight, and we hope you look forward to Syracuse University Lacrosse, which is coming up in just a matter of a couple of weeks, so check the newspapers for the time and station in your area. This has been a presentation of Cable 13 Sports and Syracuse Cable Systems.